Hey y'all, so time for another comparison video. This time we're going to be comparing Melanin Hair Care Styler along with the generic version of Shea Moisture Curl Enhancing Smoothie. We have the Curl Defining Cream. Also going to be using Echo Styler Gel, Jane Carter Solution Spray, and some hair oil. Consistency wise, they are very similar in consistency as far as thickness goes. However, the Curl Defining Cream is creamier. Oh yes, she's creamier. Um... The melanin hair care is a little bit chunkier, if that makes sense. So I'm going to be using the melanin hair care on this side first, going in with the Jane Carter leave-in spray, y'all. If you can find Jane Carter products, swoop them up because I'm noticing some changes with her line and I'm, I'm finding it very hard to find her products, especially at Sally's. So anyway, I'm going to go ahead and unravel my hair. I washed my hair about three days ago, so I definitely need, it needs some moisture. I am going to be using As I Am Grow Yogurt as a leave-in. However, I'm going to go ahead and clock my own tea, just to give you guys a heads up. I don't think that I use enough of the leave-in. Um, but we're just going to go ahead. I'm going to be setting my hair and twist you guys. This is the easiest um, style I think as far as when it comes to comparison videos. The reason why I am using Echo Styler Gel because honestly you wouldn't need it with the Curl Defining Cream. However, I find that with the Melanin Hair Care um, Styler, it needs some hold. So that's why I am pairing it with this particular gel. you guys so done with the melanin hair care side and now I'm gonna go in with the curl defining cream um, I am noticing that it is going on a little bit different you can see it's kind of sitting on top of my hair there but that's okay I'm just working it in ensuring that I smooth it in from root to end um, again this product I believe is being discontinued I have about four jars sitting in my <laughs> I'm not ashamed. I have about four jars. Uh, I have loved it so far. I've been using it for about a month now off and on. Actually, that's a lot for about two months because I have been using it on my son's hair. We have the same hair texture. I do find that a little bit goes a long way. I will say that. All right, y'all. So just continuing to set my hair and twist. <music> Alright y'all, two days later and it is time to take down. Um, this is what my hair is looking like, okay? I'm going to take my time unraveling, but I can let you know already that I know I'm going to experience some frizziness. But look at the definition. This is the melanin hair care side. And again, this right here is the Carol Curl Defining Cream, excuse me. Um, but already just filling my hair, I can tell that the Curl Defining Cream is a little bit more harder. Definition on point for both of them, but yeah, that side is better. So we're going to continue to unravel and also separate. <laughs>
right, you guys. So taking down these twists, I found that the curl defining cream was just a bit more defined. However, I experienced quite a bit of frizz on both sides. And because of that, I decided to come back in a couple of more weeks to show you guys a proper comparison videos. I feel like I owe it to you. I'm going to end up pulling these twists into a low textured bun. And so yeah, we're just going to continue to unravel my hair. <laughs> That's how we do that. A low, classy, textured bun. I'm sorry if you were expecting something fabulous, but hey. All right, you guys, so this is a couple of weeks later. I decided to do this again. However, I used a different leave-in conditioner. I used TGIN's Buttercream as my leave-in conditioner. I don't know what that is, girl, a big flake right there. Um, so what I'm going to do now is I'm taking down these Giddy Stretchy Bands. I used this actually to help stretch my hair using the banding method, basically. And my hair has been in twist now for two days. Now, I still did get a little bit of frizz towards the ends of my hair. That right there is Sweet Almond Oil. I still got a little bit of frizz. You guys, normally when I do my twists, I like to do hanging bantu knots or use perm rods because regardless of what type of products I use, I tend to get a little frizziness towards the end, but I made it work. Um, I did use the different products on the same side. So this right here would be the Melanin Hair Care and the other side will be the Shea Moisture Dupe. So I'm just gonna take my time unravel unraveling these twists and then we're gonna separate. Now, now I did make these twists a little bit smaller and let me back up. I also used the Wetline Extreme Gel. However, I used their new gel, okay, the new formula. Um, and these twists are a bit smaller. Ryan Little. <laughs> so the difference is already this is the curl defining cream which is basically the shea moisture dupe that i got from sally's beauty which by the way they probably are not making anymore um this side is longer this side is fluffier definition is great definition is great on both sides i'm gonna do a uh, side by side comparison i'm gonna put my hair up so you can definitely tell the difference now this is what's so funny the melanin hair care side way more defined um i shouldn't say way more you're gonna see here in a second basically if you're looking for a very defined and if you don't mind shrinkage melanin hair care the curl defining cream is going to give you definition some hangage if you have longer hair but it's fluffier so we're looking at a fluffier twist out versus a well-defined twist out i'm going to start to separate here um i did notice still a bit of frizz towards the ends you guys i typically like to um do hanging bantu knots or use perm rods but i was lazy girl so we're going to separate and yeah, I'm going to pull my hair up so you guys can definitely see the differences here. Thank <laughs> you. 
all right so my hair feels great overall again this is the melanin hair care look at the definition yes this is the curl defining cream great definition fluffy so my hair is way softer on that side too um, I'm going to pull my hair up so you can see what it looks like underneath still great definition and I'm going to do the same for the other side okay <laughs> all right you guys so just pinning my hair up as i stated so you can get a, a definite you know see the results here so at the end of the day again this side here is the curl defining cream it's cute she's cute <laughs> but we're gonna have to go with the melanin hair care side i mean look at the definition so yeah that is it everyone thank you so much for watching take care bye